Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Conflicts. Today I'm excited to show you the all new Spider-Man by Spiro. This is actually the most interactive product on the market yet. And it allows you to actually talk as well as hang out with Spider-Man. So it's actually a very cool as well as a unique concept. So let's go ahead and take a closer look at the box before opening it up. All right, so this here's our box, and as you can tell, it looks really cool. You got Spider-Man on the cover here with his eyes glowing. Uh, he's got like the big head and small body, so it looks really cool, almost cartoon kind. Uh, then on the side here, it kind of shows you a little bit more about it, how you can hang out with Spider-Man. Uh, in addition, you kind of let Spider-Man into your world, so he talks about his world and interacts with you. Uh, it's got a very dynamic gameplay with different sound effects as well as different like emotions. Uh, and over here, he's, it says that you know he's actually like a jokester, so he'll like crack different jokes with you and have a lot of communication. And he actually learns. Uh, in addition, he can uh, he actually has a built-in motion detector, which he can trigger different greetings, phrases, as well as all sorts of expressions. Uh, he's got uh, animated eyes where his eyes will actually blink, wink, uh, show explosion effects, and so much more. Uh, in addition, you can actually team up with him and go on missions, which you actually, uh, he'll talk to you and tell you what's going on and you get to make the decisions. He'll tell you, do you want to do this or that? And then you go based on that. So really cool. Uh, you do get your own special powers as well as your own cool name. So it's got a lot of different creativity with it. Uh, with that being said, you can also see that Spider-Man has spider sense and Spidey can sense what's going on and he'll let you know about it. Uh, in addition, it's got like web connection that allows you to get constant content updates so it'll constantly keep updating itself. So it's actually a very cool looking product. Uh, with that being said, uh, let's go ahead and take a look on this side here. So this says you get to team up with him and you could fight against different villains. So like shows Venom here. Uh, so it's really cool. You know, you get your own power ups as I mentioned previously. And then you can actually like improve yourself and make yourself a stronger character in the story. And then every decision that Spider-Man makes is a new path forward. Uh, so it's like your own unique adventure and your own story to tell. So very cool. Uh, so let's go ahead and open this up. So this just kind of slides out like that. And then right on the top here, you do see there's actually a Spider-Man logo embossed. It's kind of hard to see in the camera, but there we go. So you can see that. Uh, and then it says, uh, just very plain box here, but it does lift up like this. There we go. Uh, then on the top here, it just shows you a quick start guide. Uh, you got to plug them in, uh, download the app, and then just press this on button and go from there. So let's lift that up. And there's our Spider-Man character right there behind this plastic piece. So... Very cool. First impressions, I have to say, it's quite big. It's a little bit bigger in size than my hand here. Uh, he's got a nice rubbery feel to it. Almost feels like a basketball, I would say. Uh, actually, really does feel like a basketball. Uh, so you can see his eyes here. We'll take off these. And yeah, you can see there's LCDs back there. Uh, then his arms actually, well, they're not movable. I mean, they're movable, but they're not robotic, so they don't move on their own. Uh, and then here's like the charger port and then here's a button to turn them on so you just press this down and it'll turn on So let's put them down for now, but it looks really cool and then uh, see what else is behind this So this is his charging dock that's also in here uh, and you can see it looks like a web So he kind of just stands on this like that and then he charges himself So uh, there you go. So you just plug that into any wall and you're good to go <laughs> uh, Then over here probably is charging cables and what's yep that's this cable to plug into them so this plugs into here and then this plugs into the wall so pretty self-explanatory uh simple setup here so let's go ahead and download the app and actually start this guy and see what this is all about all right so let's go ahead and turn on spider-man uh simply just press the on button right here on the spider itself uh, and then we're going to go ahead and load up the app itself and this will actually start connecting to the spider-man and spidey's awake Alright, so this here is actually the main menu itself. Uh, kind of gives you an idea of what you can do with them. So you can team up with them, you can hang out, you can even fight villains and do so much more. At the beginning of the actual in installation process of Spider-Man, you can actually create your own name. Mine's Amazing Dude, so that's what he calls me. Uh, in addition, you do get your own power up here, so mine's Indestructible Missiles. And there's so many different things you can do with that. Now, let's just go ahead and see how this works. So let's go and click on Hangout. Now, these are a few different options you can do. So we can just say, hey, tell me a joke. What animal has more lives than a cat? I don't know. Yeah. Frogs, because they croak every night. <laughs> <laughs> Told you I was funny. <laughs> so that was pretty interesting. I kind of want to hear him say another joke. Let's try that again. What do vegetarian zombies eat? Mm, I don't know. Grains! 
<laughs> <laughs> so we can also do let's chat. So let's try that. Cool. Let's chat. Do you like being a superhero? Yes, I do. <laughs> cool. Me too. I mean, it's a lot of responsibility and stuff, but it's totally worth it. Okay, here's a silly question. What do you like better? The superpowers or the costume? The costume. The costume? <laughs> yeah, really completes the whole alter ego thing. Plus, it's nice not having to worry about what you're going to wear for every fight. <laughs> Imagine, we'd never get anything done. <laughs> <laughs> so, did you design your costume or did you buy it somewhere? I designed it. <laughs> Dude, you designed that? <laughs> wow, looks like we both have some sick tailoring skills. Way to go, us! <laughs> <laughs> Which superhero was your inspiration for that costume? Batman. Oh, nice. You have meticulous taste in superheroes. I might crib some of your style. Hope that's cool. What do you want to do now? So, that's pretty interesting. Uh, you can say, tell me a story. A story? Yeah, I got one for you. <laughs> okay, this one happened back in the early Spidey-wearing PJs days. It was a slow night on patrol. Most action I'd seen was chasing down a beagle that slipped off his owner's leash. I swooped in and saved the little guy right before he ran into traffic. So cool. I flipped back down onto the sidewalk, all ready to hand the pup back to his owner. And some big dude slams past me at full speed. If not for the old lady Percy was carrying, I might have thought he was just late for the bus. New Yorkers aren't exactly known for their manners. Without even thinking about it, I web a trash can at the corner and yank. It flies back and knocks big guy flat on his back right in front of me. Basically, the coolest thing I've ever done. And I'm still holding the puppy. Who chooses that very moment to pee all over the front of my PJs. <laughs> yeah, not only did he steal my thunder, but it also made for a very awkward convo with Aunt May on laundry day. Another day in the life of the world's coolest superhero. <sighs> So, interesting that, you know, you can actually tell you stories and you'll actually unlock more of them. Uh, you can see all the different stories on the bottom here. Uh, in addition to that, there's so many more things you can unlock, as you may already have noticed. Uh, so, let's go ahead and go back here. Now, another thing you could do besides hanging out with them is team up. Uh, this is where you can actually fight a different bad guy kind of thing, and then you just got to say something. For instance, we click on this bad guy right here. Let. So, I programmed Larry the LMD to help us practice our defensive maneuvers. Come on, let's give it a shot. Here's how it works. Larry will randomly generate the following attacks. He'll shoot, throw a punch, and charge toward you. After you hear him shoot at you, say deflect. After you hear him throw a punch, say block. And after you hear him charge at you, say dodge. Let's start off easy. Okay, Larry, are you ready? I was programmed to be ready. Oh, right. I forgot I did that. All right, Larry. When you're ready, attack. Block. When you hear Larry throw a punch, say block. Let's try another one. Whenever you're ready, Larry. Deflect. Way to deflect that shot. Hey, we did it. <laughs> One more, and then we'll take the training wheels off. <laughs> Go, Larry. Dodge. That's how you dodge a stampeding robot. Good one. Okay, I'm going to let Larry loose. Listen closely to Larry's attacks, and then say block, dodge, deflect. Or a combo of all three. You're on your own now. It's like a pattern luck. game, so let's see how let's it works. Let's go. Ring ding. School's in session four. Dodge block. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're doing this without spider sense? <laughs> Dude.
Deflect block. Check out that LM defense. <laughs> I dislike your wordplay. Dodge block. Ooh, he got ya. Ah, I knew I messed that one up. Say deflect, block, or dodge, or a combo of all three. So that's what happens when you miss. Okay. Dodge, dodge. Dodge, dodge. Perfect! Alright. There is no such thing. So let's block. Block, dodge. Oh, Larry doesn't stand a chance against you. <laughs> Cheating. <laughs> no, I'm not. Okay, let's see how you did against Lair the LMD. He attacked you five times and you successfully defended yourself four times. Excellent defense, partner. Nice. I'll get you next time. You want to play again? No. No? Okay. I'll put Larry down for a nap. So. But I'm not tired. <laughs> So they have different bad guys in here that you can actually, you know, fight against. So really interesting concept. It's like a pattern game. So very unique. So if you go back here and we go into fight villains. Uh, so it's kind of the same situation where you have to fight different villains and uh, kind of like team up with Spider-Man. So let's try that out. Sweet. Amazing dude. Spider-Man. Just a pair of powerful partners in polychromatic pajamas. Ah. Uh -huh. Tongue twister. <laughs> this is going to be so cool. I usually start the night by checking my police scanner. It doesn't always turn something up, but it's usually a good start. I'm showing a silent alarm that triggered at uh, Floyd's Electronic Depot. Any available units in the Upper East Side, please respond. Hey, I know that place. It's right across the bridge from here. Let's go check it out. It's like a story kind of telling kind the police of situation. Are still a few blocks away. I usually prefer not to be around when they show up. We could probably cover more ground if we split up, but if you want, we could search together. I'm gonna let you on point on this one. Should we split up or search together? Search together. All right, let's search together. It's probably the right move. Should we start our search in the alley or check around back first? Let's check the alley. Nice. If it were just me here. I would have started in the alley as well. <laughs> we need to hurry before those cops get here. Come on! Well, well, well. That's a pretty suspicious looking van parked right next to the depot's exit. Got any ideas on what to check first? The van? Huh. The van's windows are completely blacked out. Even the windshield? That can't be legal. And the doors are locked, too. I better take down the license plate number. It's always a good idea to gather as much info as you can from your surroundings. Yo, that's our cue. It came from the front of the depot. Time to put this crook away. Follow me! Huh, there's nothing here except a broken window. Dang it, it was just a distraction. They're getting away! Use your indestructible missiles to disable the engine before they pull my arms off. Fire? I'm not sure. Let me know when you're attacking and I'll get out of the way. Attack? Hey! I got the license plate number, but we need to get out of here now before those cops show up. Well, that was one of the strangest series of events I've seen in a while. I'll see if I can get a lead on that license plate, and I'll let you know when I find out. Amazing dude, you did great out there. What should we do next? 
So that's interesting. You know, you can always fight villains like that and you continue the story uh, until you can actually like capture the villain and then you can actually unlock so many different bad guys in here. So it's a very cool concept that they designed. Um, but then again, you know, you can also do a lot of different things. So for instance, if I just slide my indestructible missiles against them. Whoa, you just took out a super villain. I'm just kidding. Can you imagine if it were that easy? <laughs> so in addition, there's a guard mode as well as alarm mode. Uh, just some different things that you can do. Um, no, yeah, I can't imagine it either. So, you know, just it's an interesting concept that they have in here. But yeah, it's actually a lot of fun. You know, there's a lot of different talking things that you can do with them. I really love the quality of the speaker and the use of sound effects that they use with this. As well as the eyes itself, you know, they'll show like some kind of different animations and different things as well. And it's a very cool product and, you know, it actually kind of makes Spider-Man feel like he's alive. And it's a great storytelling kind of uh, feature to it. So with that being said, hope you guys enjoyed this video of Spider-Man here. And if you have any questions at all, feel free to comment down below. Otherwise, we'll see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye-bye.